show for you today. We're going to start it off with uh, Scott's wild question. That would be a uh, tiger so I can leap into the woods. A blue-footed booby because it's blue. I'd be crushed for Finding Nemo because he is the coolest character ever. I think I want to be a crocodile because I like to do things snappy. <laughs> a kangaroo so I can jump on it. <laughs> I would probably be a bear because I can tear things up. An obese gopher. I want to be a tiger or a shark. Dude, you could be a tiger shark. Oh, a what? An obese gopher. <laughs> uh, a rabbit. Why? So I could eat things and not get in trouble and still stay fast. Yes, that's a fabulous answer. Yeah, it is. So, Nate, what kind of animal would you be? I would definitely be a mayfly. How about yourself? Me, personally, I, I would definitely have to say I would be a tree. Speaking of trees, let's take a look at our next video. Hi, I'm Ben Park, reporting live from Willow Springs, where a few talented students here at Fuquay Arena High School are trying to enter the 2004 Winter Olympics with their own new original extreme sport, hillbilly bobsledding. Let's take a look at their last competition. Let's hear it for the great Disney Hunt. Hi, I'm Adam Klein. I'm the team captain. My duties as captain are to uh, keep the team spirit up and uh, lead by example. It's just a tree. Our team colors are uh, black and blue. We got that off of uh, one of our teammates, Arsenio Munez, after he kneed himself in the eye. We're gonna get we're gonna get Arsenio a helmet. <laughs> Uh, we've had a few inter-team rivalries this season. Uh, Russ and Nate, for example, they've had uh, a oh, few stick on, fights, Nate. and uh, it's been hard to get through that, but I think their uh, rivalry helps to bring the best out of everybody. Uh, we don't have uniforms, but uh, some, like Chad Brooks, he likes to wear spandex and dresses and whatnot in the woods. I'm the best player um, because I complete most of the runs and I, I, don't, I don't hurt myself so much. Uh, Nate, Nate likes to take it really slow. He's not very fast and he still hits things. And um, Russ, Russ is, uh, I, I'm hoping he gets most improved by the end of the season. He's going he's gonna to pull it together. I'm counting on that. We would be very happy to compete with other teams, but there aren't any teams right now, and we're kind of waiting for uh, somebody to pick up on the idea and uh, compete against us. So anybody who actually has their team, who hasn't, you know, started competing, we're, we're ready. We're ready for you. We'll take anybody. Be 
Good luck to all those bobsledders. Good luck on your future endeavors. That's all we've got for you today. Me and my good-looking co-host here will see you guys next week. Bye. Later.